Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to episode 40 of my Starting From Scratch series and I come up against this absolute monstrosity of a French side and wow, you know having Engo there play as centre forward, what a beast he is. In this game his shot is unreal, his finesse is unreal and he's definitely got to be one of the best silvers in the game without a doubt. But he also had Pogba in his team, uh, one of the really good French centre backs, I believe his name is like C2 or something like that. But there he unfortunately knocks it off the crossbar but he manages to cr uh, put it back in with a header and you know things just weren't going my way in this game it's already 3-0 and this guy was completely all over me but you know I managed to get a foot back in the game but this was the sort of player that would just you know as soon as he felt a bit of a threat you know uh, the comeback was most certainly on this guy felt the need to pass it around the back do a lot of time wasting and it just really killed the game because I definitely felt a comeback coming on and with ultimate team momentum you know you can certainly feel these sort of things come in and that was really nice a smelly and a very cheeky little McGee spin from Menez followed by a filthy finesse and that w that went in and that was really nice as you can see you know he was playing really deep passing it really far back but uh, you know I, I just swear I had him um, but unfortunately the guy just uh, you know I wasn't getting it at all you know he played really defensive in there um, unlucky with the first shot but fortunately the P roller managed to go in and uh, you know that player there he's one of the bronze players he is actually really quite good and uh, I pick up a penalty here and penalties are always nice to get when you're on the comeback really helps you out and you know when things are going your way when you pick up one of those and Menez definitely want to take it but uh, he pretty he sinks that pretty easily comfortably straight over the keeper's head and uh, unfortunately it did end 4-3 as he just decided passing it around the back and holding on to possession for the rest of the game was necessary. So yeah guys, I decided my strikers, you know, the two strikers that I did have were good, but I really wanted to punish teams and you know, after I come off a defeat like that, I tend to be, just be quite angry and here I'm just getting rid of all those players that I sold for my last team, which was a Dutch slash Eredivisie side. Um, but I always, I'm always in a bit of rage mode and I decide to take drastic measures and one of those drastic measures had to get Remy. What an absolute monster Remy is. Remy, I used him in in a previous starting from scratch uh, series season and wow he's incredible he truly is you know he's got a really nice finesse shot on him fantastic pace as you guys can see I think it's as 91 pace although I have heard his 95 rated player is really nothing special at all and uh, nothing to get worked up about so if I were you guys um, I just stick to getting the normal one he doesn't seem like he's worth the extra money for the 85 rated one although you know players are different for everyone and that's what I found you know for me one player might be an absolute amazing player Player, but then for the person next to me he might be absolutely awful and one of those people I noticed with was team of the year Aguero you know I spoke to some of my friends he was like he is one of the best team of the year players I've used and for me he just really didn't cut it at all nevertheless I came up against this side here he had Jimmy Briand who I might purchase in the fut future as the other striker because I remember I have had those two play together before and it was just absolute destruction on the defense but uh, there Menez picking up a really nice goal you know you know a player's good when he scores shots which are across the face of the keeper and into the left hand side especially here like you guys will see it he just you know smacks it into the bottom left and those goals are always nice and uh, it seemed it was almost too nice as the guy felt, you know, it, it was too shameful to con continue playing. And so I came up against this chap here with Ogbonna as centre-back, one of the most underrated centre-backs in the game. And uh, he's recently had an informed version. His pace is just what he's all about and a fantastic centre-back. But yeah, guys, like I was saying, you know, players can be good for certain people and bad for others. It just completely depends on uh, what formation you play them in or just how your play style is. So um, there, what I'm talking about, Remy, I mean, there's one of his goals. What a complete monster this guy is. Just incredible. As you guys saw there, his finesse shot kind of, he wasn't even balanced to shoot it. But there we go. Big Devox, I think it's Devo or something like that. I'm not, I'm not got a good French accent on me whatsoever. Um, I didn't even bother taking it in school. And uh, speaking about school, finished my last school exam today. What an absolute relief that was. Oh my gosh, I'm so pleased with that. And uh, I just, oh, it's an absolute wonderful feeling. And uh, I wish luck to anyone who still got exams. Let me know, do you chaps have exams still left? Finished my last one today. It was higher physics. And, uh, you know, it was, it was a reasonably tough paper, but hopefully I managed to pull through and at least pick something out of it. But uh, there, Remy puts it away. He's also a tall player, which also comes in handy, you know, so I can always put in the crosses so he's not just a small guy. And EA decided to BS on me and take a look at this for a goal. Yeah, I know. What the hell was that? 
couldn't believe it. Anyways, yeah, guys, thanks a lot for watching. I do appreciate it. Um, hopefully, you guys will see some squad builders and uh, maybe another episode of um, Go Big or Go Home coming up soon, as you guys definitely enjoyed that. So, hopefully, I'll give you guys that video soon. And uh, a pretty nice goal there from uh, one of the bronze players in the teams. Anyways, guys, I'll catch you all later. Bye-bye. If you could like, favorite, subscribe, share, whatever you guys do, that'd be awesome. I'll see you guys all later. Bye-bye.